Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Julio, my wife's behind the camera. This is the plug-in duo. We're gonna keep this short and sweet. So with all these rains that have been going on in California, nobody ever checks the wipers. That they're streaking or making all sorts of noises. So we're gonna fix that. This video is about switching our current wipers from the stock rubber ones into upgraded silicone wipers. So let's keep doing this and let's get it done. So first thing we gotta do is put the wipers on service mode because if you notice, the wipers sit down there by the hood. So it's really hard to get them out. So first thing you do is that you put your car into accessory mode. So you press the, you press the power button without starting the car. Press it on accessory mode. And now what you do is that you shut it off and you press and hold the wiper stock and and if you notice the wipers have come up and stay there so that you can go ahead and uh, switch out the wipers with ease so let's get that done first thing we're going to start is we're going to press this small button over here and we pull the wiper out simple as that very important be careful as this spring has a lot of tension don't let it slam into your windshield. <laughs> very, very important. This is the old one. I mean, it's still not cracked, but definitely it has seen better days. So same thing, press this button, pull it out or not. Oh my God, there we go. Again, set it down gently. Both of these are still not cracked. I wonder why they sound so awful though. They're probably just weather beaten. I see that these have the uh, aerofoil, I guess to make it more aerodynamic. Mm -hmm. So these ones are regular rubber. And the difference is that with rubber, you have to replace them every year. Like whenever it rains, that's when you notice that all of a sudden your wipers don't work, they streak, or they make that awful sound. This is what it sounds like when you have old wipers that are beat up and are not doing their job efficiently anymore. Yeah, let's get that fixed. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be upgrading our e-golf to have silicone wipers. So that is supposed to last twice as long, but I've seen articles of them lasting even longer. So if we can, if they can be even more maintenance free, even better. So this part right here is gonna fit underneath these two parts that stick out these two little wings and you're gonna push it in there until it clicks. This specific card has two different size uh, wiper arms. The 26 inch is for the driver's side, the 18 inch is for the passenger side. So right now we are doing the passenger side. Okay, so all you gotta do is literally slide this just like the other one until you hear it click. So then we're gonna do the same procedure with this one. This one is the driver's side, 26 inch. It has all sorts of different adapters so that you can put whichever style adapter fits your vehicle. For us, it's going to be this one right here, type B. We have our different, our different adapters for different car styles we pull right here from the back and so let me do it again you pull and shift forward and then pull it back and that's how it comes out then you get your appropriate adapter and same thing just backwards you make sure that these two these two little sides go underneath these two little plastic wings over here push it down and back and then you're done and then the last part is you just make sure to align it right and make sure they click in place and then lastly this you know don't forget what you do is this yellow cover you remove it that's what protects the actual silicone blade this is the silicone blade so what you do is you remove the yellow 
protector. Okay, so for the back one, we, we decided to go with this original Bosch direct fit replacement. Unfortunately, we couldn't find a rear wiper that was also uh, silicone. So we had to go with the original. And of course, since it's original, it already has the necessary hardware. You don't need to swap out the other ones, even though it wasn't that big of a deal, but let's do this. So for this one, real easy. Flip this back. Here's that square button again. Push it and you pull. Wow, look at this teeny tiny thing. <laughs> Things look, it looks like a toy. Since this is original equipment, if you notice, they are exactly the same. Even, even the, the clips, instead of being a little different, like, uh, like the Rain-X, it's pretty much the same. Um, actually, this one's just a tinsy wincy bit bigger, but same thing. Gonna slide this on here. Press that button, slide it until clicks secured. Set this back and we're done. So now that we have all the three wipers with the two front Rain-X silicone blades and the rear original uh, wiper, now here's the moment of truth. Let's start the car and let's see how this sounds. That is a lot quieter, but let's see. Let's do the same thing. No streaks. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, look at that. It's clean. And just in case, let's try the back too. All right, you guys, so you, you guys seen how easy it was to replace these wipers. I hope this video helped you guys if in case you're wondering how to replace the wipers or how to get those pesky wipers from underneath the hood that why did Volkswagen design like that? Uh, what can I say? But anyway, hope you guys found this video uh, helpful, you know, right now with all these rains. But anyway, um, if you did find it helpful, leave a like. And uh, if you guys can help us out to grow this channel, hey, uh, suggest this video and subscribe. We would love to get this uh, channel growing. But anyway, we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.